hi everyone welcome so this video is very important for the students who are preparing for mark csr net and gate examination here in this video i'm going to provide you top 100 topics uh, so in this top 100 topics actually uh, the topics which uh, actually i'm showing on board these topics are very uh, you know uh, minimum number of topics but you have to uh, search for the subtopics in this uh, main topics right so i will tell you how to <coughs> check subtopics in this main topics so if you collectively uh, see these subtopics and main topics totally you will get 100 topics right so if you prepare these 100 topics these topics are more than enough to uh, crack any examination because uh, generally <coughs> examiner often ask questions on these topics only right so these are very very important topics so just try to prepare these uh, topics in the 40 days of your csr net and uh, these topics are more than enough for your gate and bark also right okay let's start so first of all if you observe the first one is the first topic very very important topic so you can see <coughs> uh, every time you can see questions on these topics so acids and base uh, acids and basic trends so if you see organic chemistry so acidic and basic trends are very very important so in this acidic and basic trends so mainly <coughs> so applications of aromaticity so here only you have to see the aromatic questions so just see when it comes to organic chemistry so many uh, students are just uh, suffering because I'm, I'm getting miles also on this uh, uh, actually uh, so many students are are worrying about organic chemistry you don't need to worry about organic chemistry so just listen organic chemistry if you want to remember the concept if you want to uh, you know um, if you want to keep the concept into your mind this is not at all possible so just give a read of every topic in organic chemistry and after that so just try to practice more and more questions on organic chemistry because this branch especially organic chemistry is just practice based so if you do more practice then you can able to do more questions on organic chemistry okay there is no other alternation at all so if you want to uh, get more score in organic chemistry you have to practice a lot right so i'm suggesting you if you take aromaticity chapter so just do all the questions uh, which actually came in previous years right previous year uh, aromatic questions are more than enough so just just do that questions so in that aromaticity questions only you can get you can um, you can see the questions uh, the questions on the application of acids and bases so as acidic and basic trends and next one is in general organic chemistry uh, sir effect and sip effect, sip effect so steric inhibition of resonance and steric inhibition of protonation you have to remember that and benzoic acid that question is also very very important because uh, ortho effect so according to ortho effect at the ortho position even if you have the electron donating group and electron withdrawing group that is more acidic one right and uh, sir effect sip effect so after taking the proton it will um, it will experience some hindrance so that's why it cannot take hydrogen that is sip effect so uh, whenever it is not taking hydrogen according to the sip effect basicity will decrease according to sir effect uh, basicity will increase you have to remember these important points and after that stability of intermediates you have to see all the intermediate stability and you have to do practice questions on intermediates okay just do previous year questions previous year questions of organic is more than enough you don't need to practice anything extra next anisomeric excess anisomeric excess you can you can um, uh, actually um, uh, at least one question right you can see on anisomeric excess right so try to solve questions on anisomeric excess also so next one confirmations in this confirmations mainly you have to focus on uh, hydrogen bonding confirmations for suppose you take normally anti is more stable right so but if you have the hydrogen bonding then in that case gauge is more stable than anti right so you have to uh, see those confirmations and you have to do you have to do uh, questions on those confirmation topic also right so next one is anisotopic and diastereotopic and homotopic protons in, in stereochemistry so stereochemistry these are very very important so just read the rules of this anisotopic homotopic and diastereotopic and do questions on that so next one rs and dz nomenclatures this is this is also very very important and when it comes to ir ir in ir spectroscopy you have to remember ir stretching frequencies these ir stretching frequencies are very very important for your inorganic chemistry also and also in organic chemistry right so you have to solve the questions on ir spectroscopy right ir spectroscopy stretching frequencies 
so next one is nmr uh, structural elucidation definitely you can see one question on this and number of signals okay you can see uh, definitely questions are number of signals also these two concepts are very very important in nmr spectroscopy and moreover already i made a video on organic chemistry complete video dedicated video on organic chemistry so uh, i'm going to provide that organic chemistry uh, important topics video in description okay you can check that uh, you can check that video also so if you watch that video you can get a complete idea on organic chemistry right so next one is maclefortian rearrangement in mass spectroscopy so the maclefortian rearrangement is very very important for your gate and net both and when it comes to uh this intensity ratio right these two topics are very very important and number of signals you have to see in 13c nmr and 1h nmr in both right in 13c and 1h nmr you have to uh, know how to count the number of signals and when it comes to mass spectroscopy maclefortian rearrangement is very very important and after that intensity ratio only practice the questions on this maclefortian rearrangement and intensity ratio bio molecules you don't need to study entire bio molecules just to study most important things only right just to study most important things on bio molecules and you have to remember the structures glucose fructose okay uh, some carbohydrate structures some amine structures are there you have to uh, remember those structures okay aniline like structures so next one is diels alder reaction in reaction in um, pericyclic reactions very very important please don't um leave this diels alder reaction right you have to practice all type of questions on diels alder reaction at least one question um you can you can see in your question paper right so next one is heck coupling and um heck coupling is very very important right so remaining couplings are also there but on remaining uh, couplings try to remember the metal which is responsible for that particular coupling right so nagai share coupling is there and remaining all kumuda coupling is there so remaining coupling reactions are also there but heck coupling reaction you have to study and practice questions on heck coupling and remaining coupling reactions try to remember the metal names right so next one is wackers process and mansard to acetic acid process in inorganic organometallic compounds very very important topics these two are so don't miss these topics so uh, do questions on wackers process and named reactions already i have uh, Uh, i have discussed about this named reactions important named reactions in my organic chemistry video i'm going to provide that uh, link in the description you can check there right so next one is raoult's law so you have to prepare these topics you have to do questions on these topics by doing by doing the questions you can get sub topics in this in this main topics right so if you see collectively those sub topics and main topics you can get totally 100 topics approximately right so next one is raoult's law raoult's law especially for gate point of in gate point of view raoult's law is very very important so i will try to make a video on raoult's law so if you want so you don't need to worry so next one half life and order of reaction kin chemical kinetics arrhenius equation right arrhenius equation half life and order of reaction these three are very very important in chemical kinetics and remember when it comes to physical chemistry try to just remember the formulas more okay so try to uh, remember the concept which is required only and more, uh, more and more try to remember the formulas and do questions okay for organic and for, for physical chemistry you need more practice for inorganic you have to uh, remember more theory okay because conceptual things are there in organic chemistry so you have to remember the theory but when it comes to physical chemistry and organic chemistry practice a lot right so just remember the formulas of all uh, all uh, chapters of physical chemistry and try to do the questions and michaelis menten plot plot very very important and when it comes to polymers chemistry i don't need to discuss about this polymers because very easy topic and very very small uh, small chapter so number average molar mass weight average molar mass those formulas are there so frequently asking questions are there so you can focus on those frequently asking questions in polymer chapter next point groups and character table in in group theory point groups are very very important character table is very very important at least you can see one question either on point groups or on character table so next one de bayhockel limiting law de bayhockel limiting law is very very important for gate and net especially for gate de bayhockel limiting law is very very important just try to remember only one formula de bayhockel limiting law only one formula is there you have to remember that formula and do questions on gate and net right so next nernst equation electrochemistry very very important solid state in solid state 
try to remember a density formula is there zm by a cube n a so that is one formula and bracks equation you can see uh, at least one question on those topics very very important topics so next one maxwell equation so maxwell equations are very very important thermodynamics so maxwell thermodynamics square very very important and entropy of mixing again one formula is there on entropy of mixing you have to remember that formula this entropy of mixing is very very important for your gate examination and bark examination also right so these all topics are important for bark examination also okay because in bark examination also you can see more questions on these topics only right so next isotopic substitution so uh, in your spectroscopy again rotational spectroscopy uh, you can see the questions on isotopic substitution right so next so these these topics are about physical and organic chemistry when it comes to inorganic chemistry we don't need to discuss about inorganic chemistry much because especially we have two important chapters coordination chemistry and uh, organometallics if you cover those chapters they, they are very uh, they are more than enough right 70 60 to 70 percent syllabus only your question paper will depend on those two uh, chapters but still i'm going to give you uh, uh, some important things in coordination chemistry in coordination chemistry term symbols are very very important right so diatomic molecules molecular um, molecular term symbols atomic term symbols and especially molecular term symbols are very very important and you have to know the transitions right how to uh, you know identify the transitions in molecular term symbols they, they are very important and electronic configurations color spectra color spectra is very very important crystal field theory is very very important and next one is argal diagrams are very very important magnetic movement is very very important right um color spectra is very very important and you have to remember the orders right uh, square planar geometry uh, uh, octahedral geometry you have to remember the energy orders right and when it comes to chemical bonding vscpr theory very important molecular orbital theory very important right and organometallics organometallics 18 electron rule very important because you can see more questions on organometallics and coordination chemistry only right try to cover those 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 two chapters and try to do every question regarding that coordination chemistry and organometallics right so they are more 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 than enough and if you want to study chemical bonding f block d block they are very very simple chapters if you give just one day time or two day time you can you can easily cover those all topics and uh, and uh, just try to observe the previous year question papers according to the previous year question papers you can eliminate the topics actually right so you can analyze which are important which are not important according to that you can prepare other topics but when it comes to coordination and organometallics don't leave anything just try to analyze the question papers of previous years according to the previous years try to uh, prepare every topic of organometallic and coordination chemistry right so these are the main topics and sub topics so prepare these topics only then definitely you can qualify in in a very very short time right so sir thank you so much